keep just saying that. <laughs> yeah, don't say anything bad about anyone. Because you're like, yeah, you're like the worst smack talker ever. Well, my hair is, is officially winter. My hair looks like this. It's great. Um, also, it's snowing here in New York. Can't even see. Normally, you see the sky skyline, but. Um. I like white bread too. I'm um, specifically I like sourdough, French. <laughs> Hopefully I'll be able to leave. I'm sure I'll be able to leave because this won't be bad. This isn't like a storm. This is like, it's like a nice flurry. Oh, that's a cute little. That's a cute name for a cat, Flurry. Aww. And then you can nickname her Mick Flurry. Yo, I'm a genius. But it's snowing. Part of me wishes I was in New York for crema. Then I'd be alone. Which isn't actually bad. I could just change my flight. Definitely want to go to Central Park tomorrow, though. That's for sure. Um. We just finished uh, on passing Drew's apartment building. Um. Just finished episode 16's table read. The wonderful Benjamin. Well, I don't think he likes that name. Ben McKenzie is directing. I didn't get to work with him. The, uh, well, now you can really see where I am. I didn't get to work with him the first time he directed, so I'm excited. Yes, we did find Sabby. Thank you. chocolate melting in my hand. I don't know why. I just find that so uncomfortable. It's like you can't I can't get a grip. And like I want it to be grippy, but like I don't I just don't know. I just don't know how it Now I don't. 
Thank you. Um, haven't worked out in a while. So now I have a triple chin. It's nice. It's real nice. Makes me feel really good about myself. <laughs> it's true though, like when you gain weight, that's like the first place you see it. And now it's just like my face is just like a swollen potato. Instead of like a steamed peeled potato. My face is a baked potato. Now you look at my face and you can't see anything but a baked potato, can you, Keith? Mm-hmm. Camera potato head. Baked potato. It's alright. I'll get back there, you know what I mean? Gotta let, let life take the wheel, you know? I'm not saying I'm ugly. Just because I gain weight don't mean I'm ugly. Show. <laughs> Someone said, no, you're cute. I said, I know I'm cute. I know I'm cute, Keith. Just because you gain weight doesn't make you ugly. You're still pretty. That goes for everyone. Am I right or am I right? Preach on. Chinny chin chin. Ayy. Chin chin chin. Ayy. Chinny chin chin. Ayy. Chinny chin chin. Ayy. Triple chin. Double chin. Single chin. All beautiful. Triple chin. Chin. Double chin. Single chin. All beautiful. Ayy. Chinny chin chin. Ayy. See, I made a song out of my potato face. If you don't think I'm cute, then get out my face. Away. Oh, I said face already. I made a song out my potato thighs. You think I'm ugly, then get out my way. Ooh! <laughs> Bars. Potato short and swollen. Here is my eyes and the uh, here is a pimple. <laughs> Keith is over me. Look at I don't have a I don't know too much about the history of jazz. I just love it. And I've just, I got, I recently got Apple Music, and, um, I've just been putting on the pure jazz radio, I've just been jamming. I'm going home. I'm gonna finish unpacking these boxes, what? Hashtag adulting. Oh, this is really cool. Look at this. If I could have a filter, I would. No, I don't want to focus on the droplets. Mom. What kind of baked potato? I am a hybrid of a sweet potato and a red potato. Boom. Hashtag GMO. Because I love sweet potatoes. I'm sweet. I'm scrumptious. I'm wholesome. 
but then also the red potatoes have some flavor. You know what I mean? Red potatoes have flavor. So I'm sweet and I'm flavorful. Therefore, sweet potato, red potato, hybrid. I got a new jacket. Feels nice. Um, I am on this. Oh, question. Uh, actually, no. If anybody lives in either the East Coast or just somewhere really cold, do you have any uh, suggestions for jackets that are cruelty free? Because I've been wearing Canada Goose and I learned that they are not cruelty free. And. I don't want to be a hypocrite and be for animals' rights and then be wearing Canada Goose. So, if you have any suggestions for jackets for um, really cold weather, that would I would really appreciate that because I've been um, I've been trying to figure out what to buy. I can't do purple potatoes because it's like, are you a red potato or are you a normal one? Pick. Oh, wow, Keith. Look at you. You look like a Pac-Man. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah. Can you see? Hmm. It's pretty cool. Thank you. I love them. I think they're Capricorn things. North Face. No, I'm not really into Michelle Pfeiffer. If I was, my journey would be a little easier. Patagonia. I'm from San Diego. Do you know how cold it is right now, Keith? 28 degrees. 28 degrees Fahrenheit. It's snowing. degrees is not okay. It was five degrees the other day. I was like, just like that. That was really dramatic when he picked me up. Oh no, seven degrees. Oh no. But nobody really answered my question. Does everybody just wear Canada Goose? Because, well, that'd be awkward. putting a filter on my boss. What do you think? What do you think, Kate? Go for it. What kind of filter? Yep. This is how I feel right now. Yo, chemistry is cool if you have a great teacher. No! Chemistry, excuse me, sir. Oh my god, it keeps freezing over! Oh no, this filter is not the one. Alright, I'm gonna just go with this. It's nice and, nice and aesthetically pleasing. Not too high maintenance, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. 
Oh, I don't know. I don't know if Gotham is moving to ABC. That would be interesting. You are so funny with your story posts. I'm not a troll. Yo, no, I'm not a troll. Trolls like... Trolls like to... They're just negative. I'm not negative. There's this thing where people think that speaking your mind requires negativity, and that's not the case. Like, you don't have to... You don't have to talk crap about someone to be real. You know? I don't know. I'm definitely not a troll. My my intentions are always good. By by Yan Yuo. Okay. I'll let that. Thank you. Biannual. North Face or Biannual. You supposed to. You supposed to jump for transportation. What? Wait, wait. Oh, because I'm Catwoman. Haha, <laughs> well, Selena's not about the snow, so she'll find anything she needs to. I did meet the actor who plays Martin. His name's Christopher, and he's the sweetest thing, and he's really talented. What I love most about the show is um, I have a personal driver. He doesn't speak. He's mute. <laughs> He's a great listener. No, <laughs> I'm just kidding. Keith is great. I love him. He listens to all my rants, all of my... Uh, road rage as a passenger. And he's not mute at all. Which I enjoy. Can I rent your eyes for my girlfriend? Boy, you better love your girlfriend's eyes for what they are. Show. Sure. Yeah, you better love your girlfriend's eyes for what they are. I love Vikings. I like Vikings more than Game of Thrones. It's just less confusing for me. Yeah, I'm an only child. I haven't really been watching any TV. Keith laughed at my mouth fart. <laughs> hey, yeah. The Moon has a new album out? No, I did not know this. Did you know this? The Moon has a new album out? Yep. Yeah. You weren't gonna let me know? No. Wow. I thought our friendship was different, Keith. I thought we had a, I thought we had each other's backs. No one comes to Eminem. Wow. Okay. Duly noted. Well, you know what? The next time the next remix for Mi Gente comes out, I'm not gonna tell you. You're so cruel. <laughs> he doesn't even listen to Latin music. <laughs> Do you? I don't feel like you're close to it. I listen to pretty much anything. Yeah. Yeah. I 
I like that new song though. Cause you know downtown is the only like English word in there, you know. So that's the only lyric I know. It's good. Now this is a story about all about how my life got flipped, turned upside down, and I would like to take a minute and just sit right there, tell you how I became the prince of a town called Bel Air. I need to fix that. Hold on. Now this is a story all about how my life got flipped, turned upside down, and I would like to take a minute and just sit right there, tell you how I became the prince of a town called Bel Air. Oh, bars. Hashtag cover. Hashtag Grammys. Hashtag. Best new artist. <laughs> did I do a dance to Unforgettable? Oh yeah, I did, huh? Someone said, can I see the face drivers? Um, with that question, I don't think I should show you. Because, I don't know, that's just weird. No, it's not. I'm just being stupid. There's his, there's his profile. That's all you get, his profile. Trisha's watching. She is? Yeah. Is she? Yeah. Hi, Trisha! Thank you for the gifts. I love them. Despacito. Conmigo. Despacito. Puerto Rico. I know I don't need the Grammys. I know they need me. Thank you for knowing my worth. Part of me thinks that unicorns actually did exist, though. Maybe not the flying. But there must have been an anim- a horse-looking animal that had one horn coming out of its head that people were just like, Oh, that's pretty. Let's kill it and have it for ourselves and just, like, keep it in the family. And not eat any of it and not use the entire body. Let's just cut the horn off. And I guarantee there was something similar to a unicorn that is extinct because of people. Because we're doing it now and people don't make stuff up. I'm pretty sure unicorns were real. I wouldn't be surprised. No, you're your own savior. Well, I don't like this filter. It makes me look like my skin's perfect. That's weird. This big is my hair. A lot of people stare. Um, I wear sunglasses to prevent the flare of people's lights when they're coming at me with uh, I write a lot, like I write a lot of poetry, so you'd think that it'd be in my head, but a lot of the poetry is really dark, so, (laughs) not really.
really good bar material. Let's see, bear care. Oh. Um. This big stuff is my hair. A lot of people stare. It needs extra tender love and care. So that the flare doesn't have it wear and tear. So that it stays right there. Ooh. too much about Disney. I don't know. I, I, whoa. These are on my forehead now. I don't know. I don't. Whoa. Jeez. I'm just going to hold my ear here. Um, I don't know too much about that business part of uh, Gotham. But Disney buying it. I don't know too much about it. So I can't speak on it. Um, I use a lot of Saint makeup cosmetics. Um, they're cruelty free, they're vegan, and the eyeshadow stays on, the lip liner stays on, on. Um, it's really great products. They're, I, I, I use It's foundation, or I use Lancome foundation, because It, I can't, uh, or a Saint, I can't find the proper shade for me yet, but, um, yeah, I love Saint Cosmetics. Saint It. No, I'm not vegan. I just like a vegan makeup brand. I, I, I would have to go through a major, major transition and live in California to be vegan. It's too expensive to be a vegan in New York. I'm sorry. I don't know how people do it. I, I don't know, because even buying freaking sandwich meat, packaged sandwich meat is like five bucks. So, buying organic plants and tofu and all that stuff, I don't know, I, I would have to live in California eh, for that. But, um, I think that's enough for the day. Uh, I will, um, talk to you later, if I come back on here later. Okay, bye-bye now.